So, I wrote a letter um, to a group that helps defend the rights of people who are different. Um, and I'm not going to read the whole thing out because uh, most of the thing uh, has been described in videos that I've made on here previously. Um, but I just want to mention this section, this paragraph. So... I take pills even from people I disagree with. I will not take injections. I do not want them, and they are not necessary as I am not violent. And even if I have violent thoughts, it is because being peaceful is killing humans, all animals and insects, and the planet itself. And that is something you should go to war over. People are sitting idly by as they are being sentenced to death and asked to pay for it in the consumption of plastic, oil, and gas. We pay to live and pay to die. Not just cemetery costs, but everything we interact with to get to the grave, including our food, is made to kill us. And then they tell me I should consider myself mad for being upset about it and doing everything, even going into the collective unconscious and acting out narratives I have written in order to fully realize and probe the resonance. I could ask for war and I would be right. I could ask for violence and it would be righteous. Instead, I merely speak my opinions. I am, for the most part, a pacifist. So, that paragraph, I would be right to ask for a violent response to the fact that we have to pay our way to the grave. And the things that we're paying for tend to kill us unless we pay a premium, then we'll get healthier stuff. And you can say the soft puppy interpretation is that they're trying so hard to feed the populace even though the populace is going to rapidly and we have malfusion issues um that uh they just give us anything that can keep us um well fed that is cheap but um i was basically starving for the past five months basically starving and even though i lost weight i still have a belly um i shouldn't have a belly and it's because the food that they give poor people is the same food that they give to livestock in certain ways, the same food groups that they're using for livestock and for poor people, because this will fatten them up and make their complaints about the food quality seem irrelevant because look how fat you are. Look how fat you are. How can you complain? You're fine. It's a deception. It's really, really sinister. It's really sinister and it's not a mistake. I'm sorry, it's just not. For some person, this works and this helps obfuscate their villainy. And they should get got. Asking for violence would be righteous. But I do not because we don't need to. It's not that necessary to get violent about it. Just displace them. I have taken my request down from the moon because the moon... I have had this in my simulation that I run. I had somebody who um, was a child that I babysat, who was very um, in tune with nature. They told me in my simulation that I was running, and yes, I sound crazy. Don't fuck with me. I don't care. It's a spiritual thing. Leave me alone. Um, they told me that the moon is the moon. The moon is special. The moon is a celestial thing. Like you can't just blemish the moon with the worst of humanity so i think they belong with the garbage in the ocean pacific garbage patch put them on boats and um because we're going to be shipping less there's enough room on these boats that are going to be decommissioned to either um put them at sea and have these people um clean up the pacific garbage patch whatever is left of it and also start just basically um, making their own food and giving us an idea of is it possible to have um, a livable situation on the water if places and coastlines get flooded out? Can we go on the water and live? And they are the ones who carried the experiment and they help fix the problem that they created. I think that's a fair, 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 fair fucking punishment. And I think that it would be a healing thing. A healing. And most punishment is not healing. Most punishment in our society is just sweeping it under the rug. They wouldn't be swept under the rug. They would be in the Pacific garbage patch. They would be growing their own things and fishing and cleaning up the water and living apart from the people that they have decided that they want to subjugate and 